Hi, yo guys, it's Alex from Flashaholics. How you guys doing? I know I haven't uh, done a video lately. Uh, there really hasn't been anything out, but now there is. Uh, you know, Jelly Bean with that leak that came out that I showed that uh, video of the leak. Uh, a lot of developers have been working on it, and now I've, I've just found a good stable ROM for you guys. Uh, I'm going to review it right here. Um, it's ex it's called Exquisite ROM. Uh, the developer's name is Wildchild. You can find it on XDA. Um, comes with themes. So I have the white theme, of course, because I have the white Galaxy S3. So here you go. So this is what it looks like. As you see, it's Jelly Bean. So here's the white theme. Um, the good news is that they finally got Google Wallet's work on Jelly Bean, uh, which is great. Um, and so, because that's one of the reasons why I didn't want to uh, do Jelly Bean, because I like Google Wallet. I like to play with it. I like to you know go and buy buy things with it. But now with Jelly Bean, you can get Google Wallet. So, uh, which I'll post the link how to do it. It's similar to the other link. Uh, that I had to do it on, on ICS. Uh, just a couple different modifications, different names you have to put on there. So, but this is the toggle. Um, so, just base toggles. So, this what looks like white. Um, it's pretty good. I kind of modified it to make it fast, uh, which I'll show you how to do in this video. Real simple, but as you can see, it's, uh, I made it super fast. Um, and it's real simple to do. Uh, you just have to play with some certain numbers and then uh, save it on your root explorer file and then reboot and you're good to go. So uh, this one looks like, as you can see, the, the files are kind of different. Um, see, I like the file system on it. Uh, of course, Google Now uh, works. You can have the Google Now. Uh, the only thing you get new on this ROM is you're gonna get DS DSP Manager, which is like your awesome beats, your audio beats. Um, so that's the only thing. That's pretty much it. Uh, it comes pretty much stock. Uh, what you could do though, it has aroma, uh, which gives you a basic installation how you want to do it. It's gonna, it's not gonna be like your normal installation. It's gonna pop up like a like a like a la carte menu of what you want to put on this ROM. Also the kitchen comes with the which I'll post it in here and that's also the same thing after you flash the ROM you set everything up you, you do your, uh, your your emails and then you set up your apps then you want to flash the kitchen and then it's going to be just like an all cart what themes you want uh, there's kind of different themes already on there if you want to do specific themes or you want to do customize your own thing I just customize my own theme to get the white because uh, the other ones are like jelly bean and black and blue or Black, uh, blue and black, and I don't, I don't want that because I, I got white. So other than that, it's a really good ROM, stable, uh, no have any issues at all, um, no vibration issues, no hiccups. I use Netflix, I use YouTube, I use Facebook, I use Twitter, I use uh, all those things. YouTube, everything works. It's perfectly fine. Uh, like I said, it's it's almost uh, stock basically. Uh, now that we're not going to get apparently. We're not going to get Jelly Bean, I, I heard, till January or February, which doesn't matter to me because I got Jelly Bean already. But uh, this is what it looks like. This is very fast. Um, like I said, I'll show you how to modify. Um, it's stock to uh, stock TouchWiz. Just give it a second. And as soon as, I, as soon as it loads, it could be pretty quick. Pretty quick for you guys. Uh, stock TouchWiz. So... The other thing, um, you don't get the media hub, like if you want to watch Avengers, which I don't know if you guys knew, but because you're Samsung Galaxy S3 owners, you get Avengers for free off of media hub. Um, I think there's an issue. Yeah, it says signal too weak or busy try again. That's the only thing, really. And it's only because it's jelly beans, so uh, try it out. Uh, to do that modification, so you're going to go into Root Explorer. Once you download it, once you do everything, go to your system. Make sure it's an RO like I taught you. Go to your system. Go to your build props. Click on it. And then uh, make sure it's on RO. And then you want to go all the way down where it says additional uh, build props. Like this one says tweaks on it. So... If you go right here, the first one you want to do is you want to adjust the one that says Windows Manager Max Events Per Sec. 
Uh, normally on the ROM, it's like 180. You want to put it at 300. That'll make it faster. And then you want to put your RO max fling velocity to 16,000. And then your minimum velocity to 8,000. That's what's going to make your uh, make it fast. Your way it see how the way it goes like that. That's fast. So, like I said, it comes with Google Now. Um, I'll show what you have to do for Google Wallet. You set it up is all you have to do is I'll give you the the zip you need. First, you put the you flash the zip. Go into your bill props, which I showed you was the system bill props, and then you want to change. I don't know if you can see it, but you want to change it to these three lines. You want to put a Galaxy Nexus. The next one row product name is Rack Jew. The next row product device is MAGURO. So once you do that, you save it. You actually you can download the Google Wallet that's from the Play Store. Download that and then set it up that way. It's going to say, um, it will say that unsupported device on there. But don't worry about it. It works. Like it says, un it's only because you're rooted. Don't worry about it. It works perfectly fine. Everything's perfect. Um, so other than that, this one comes with the, the upgraded Play Store, which is pretty cool. Um, so other than that, it's uh, that'll make it faster for you. And you can still do the sounds, like if you want to tweak your sounds, like as you can hear. My sounds are different. Uh, you still do that, which I showed you how to do that. Um, other than that, it's a really good ROM. I probably really recommend it. Um, like it's very stable. Jelly Bean for right now until apparently we'll get January, December. We'll get the official Samsung. There has been a, an official Samsung Samsung firmware that just came out today. Uh, it's still ICS but with new updates. So I'm going to try that after this. Um, so if you want to try it, go ahead. See what. See what you like. If you have any comments or anything, I always re always try to respond as fast as I can. Uh, but enjoy. Thanks, guys. See you later.